Jim never gave up, kept on fighting even after Tyler was convicted. I became convinced that there were so many errors in the trial that surely this could be reversed. And in 2007, the court ruling was overturned when he discovered that the pathologist who handled Joey's body was uncertified. The state didn't want a retrial. Instead, they offered the now 18-year-old Tyler a manslaughter plea deal, guaranteeing his release if he pled guilty to killing Joey. But Tyler was innocent and ready to risk everything in a second trial to prove it. If he had taken the manslaughter plea, he would have been out of jail in just a few months. Whereas if he goes to trial and is convicted, he gets life in prison. But that was the strongest indication to me that Tyler was innocent. Wade's first witness was Christy herself, who had been sentenced to death following her own murder trial four years ago. Miss Forger, you're Tyler Edmonds' sister, is that correct? On the advice of my attorney, I'm not answering any questions. And she takes the fifth to every question.